Today, we're going to be reacting to 80s performing the song Turbulence for the first time ever. Now, I'm really excited about this for many reasons. One, I've never heard this song before. Two, it's 80s live. Three, this morning I got tickets to see 80s in London. Yes, they're going to be my first ever K-pop experience live. I'm so excited. So much so I was like, right, well, I need to react to something 80s like right now. And what better way than a live performance? Guys, let me know. Have you seen 80s live? What is your favorite 80s live track? And also, are you going to be coming to this European slash UK tour? Let me know. If you're going to be in London, let me know. I'll, I'll, I'll see you there. Now, as always, if you want to see these videos weeks and weeks ahead of YouTube, completely in full and uncut, I do have a Patreon link. That is down in the description below. You're going to see all of the live performances, full album reactions, variety content, K-dramas, and more. The link to that is down below. But guys, that said, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and let's go. Okay, I'm very excited for this. Now, I don't think we've got subtitles, though. There's no captions on this, so we're just going to enjoy, enjoy their beautiful voices. Oh, I love this style for them. I love the fits too. Oh my god. Oh. They're perfect, honestly. And also, a live band just makes everything always sound so much better. Don't you guys think? It has like a different energy to it. A much more of a rawness as well. Also, I love these kind of like film sessions because you truly get to hear them. There's no like loud backing track. There's no like loud fans. There's no pyrotechnics. Nothing crazy going on. You're just hearing their voices. And I, I, I'm all for it. Hmm. He has such a nice singing voice. Oh, Jesus. Oh, there's my king right there. Oh, his voice sends me over the edge, man. Wow, dude. Oh. Dude, I'm getting chills. I actually cannot believe that I'm actually going to see them live. I still remember when I first did my first ever reaction to them when we did Gorilla, and I just knew I was like headbanging. I was I was screaming my head off. And that was like one of the first things I heard when doing K-pop. It was quite early on. And then, you know, Jongo's voice is just something that I've always just felt straight up. He's one of the best singers I've ever heard. And now we're sat here getting ready to go see them and watching them play Turbulence live. I hope they play this song live. Oh, dude, their voices are unbelievable. Oh, this really works well with his voice. It cuts through nicely. Oh, the way they bounce off. Oh, the camera work too, man. Oh, let's go. Dude, this song is amazing. Oh, his voice is crazy. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm in heaven. The great thing about 80s is they are just like so all round. I mean, like they can all do everything. And vocally, now that we're hearing them like completely raw, nothing else in the background, we can just truly hear how incredible they are. And this, the thing is, with 80s is the, the, the variety of their sound is just so crazy. You know, they can go from Gorilla to Halazia to Bouncy to this, and it all works just because of how versatile and how incredibly they are as vocalists. Oh, man. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm in heaven right now. He sounds amazing. 
끝에 우린 여기서 지금 모습으로 다시 돼야 한다면 나는 내가 되기를 바래 Dude, imagine just being able to be with your boys and be like that. I do harmonies! What the fuck? Oh, God, no, stop. My ovaries, I don't have any, but they're exploding. Oh my God, dude. Oh. Stop it! Ah! Oh. Wow, dude. It's incredible just how bloody incredible they are. They make it look easy. I mean, this is just, they're sat on chairs just chilling. Sounding like goddamn, I, I, I didn't even know, angels. You know what? I normally don't like to listen to music like if in the live setting first. I normally want to hear the, the studio version first and then hear the live version. But I'm actually really glad that I heard it this way first because vocally that was just such an incredible performance that I love the rawness of it and the power of it to really hear it like that. I think that was the best way to actually hear it. Guys, let me know what did you think of this performance? What other songs in this setting would you like to hear them perform? And actually, have they done any others? And if so, would you like to see me react to it? Let me know. Now, like I said, if you want to see all of these videos weeks before they hit YouTube, I do have a Patreon. The link to that is down description below. You can see all the live performances, full album reactions, variety content, K-dramas, and more. The link to that is down below. But guys, I'll see you in the next one.